I, I mean, I have very strong negative feelings towards anybody part of Scientology. It's true. That's and there are some actors that I really liked who I lost a ton of respect for uh, when I found out they were part of Scientology. Such as like um uh so Elizabeth Moss mm. um she was she was in uh, she was the main character in Handmaid's Tale. Mm. And uh, she was in Invisible Man, the new, the recent horror movie. Yeah, I know that checks out. I didn't like her just um, because she acted that way. But okay. yeah, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, she's she's a Scientologist. Um, uh, Danny Masterson, who played uh, Hyde in that '70s show, really Scientologist. Aww. Yep. And I think his one of his siblings, his sister, maybe. Um. Also, Donna. I forget her name. The the girl, who, the woman who played uh, Donna, is also a Scientologist. Huh. Um. Um. The guy who voiced Chef on. Uh, <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, was it Isaac something? Well, he left because they made know, fun he, of Scientology. He, yeah, he he left because they fucking ripped into Scientology, and he left the show because of it. And then they kept using his um, voice for like an episode afterwards. Yeah. They did what I was going to do with you and just piece all of your words together. Mm -hmm. Hello, children. <laughs> Hello, children. Um, there's a few other ones that I can't think of right now. There's some surprising ones on there, though. I have to look up. Huh. Good. Made it. Okay. Interesting. Um... Yeah, I like, my mom watches that Leah Remney show where the chick who was part of Scientology who left Scientology because she understood that she was a part of Scientology. Um, <laughs> yeah. And then wrote, I think she, it wasn't, what was her name? Leah Remney. She was on uh, King of the Hill. Or no, not King of the Hill. Um, no, yeah. King of Queens. That's the one. With the uh, guy who's friend, Ke Kevin something, who's friends with. Okay, this is not the person I was thinking of. Because um, I'm saying like. Um, Tom Cruise had a, uh, a wife that he kind of like convinced to join Scientology and then they split because she was like, this is fucking a cult. No, it wasn't her. Uh, she, she left no, fairly, was thinking of. she left within the last 10 years, I think. Um, and then they went after her because she, uh, she like smashed into pieces and told all kinds of mm -hmm. stories about how they do weird indoctrination rituals and. Mm -hmm. How the leader killed his yeah, wife and very it's like, clearly. And... Yeah, it's like these weird indoctrination rituals. It's these weird um, isolation like, hold that the, yeah that they have on the members, and then like people. So the I listened to the last podcast on the left, and they do a whole like five, four or five part series on Scientology. And, like it's fucking crazy, and they theorize that like some of these people. They think only stay in as long as they do, especially rich people, uh, because they've invested so much money into the cult, and they're like, "Well, if I leave now, then I'm admitting that I'm wrong, and I wasted all this money, so like I can't leave." Yeah, because I can't be wrong. God forbid I'd be wrong. God forbid I look like a fucking idiot. God Let forbid I admit that I jump look up like and an down idiot. on yeah. Oprah's show on a couch, and that'll be a meme for a while. Yeah, like it's it's nuts. Yeah, I would I would rather own up uh, to my mistake than continue making mistakes. Yeah, well, so so it's something that happens a lot with a lot of people in cults is that like they, it, because a lot of cults require that you essentially cut ties with their friends and family. It's like you have nothing left. Yeah. So if you leave now, like you're on your own, and like you can't like the shame of going back and admitting that oh yeah I was in a cult and I was wrong, uh, is just too much for a lot of people. Yeah, I'm, that's they go after the most susceptible people too. It's similar to how they start pimping people when they, you know, they fly them out to California and then they isolate them and then they they say, oh well, you're stuck. And then they're like, well, I guess it's not the worst thing. I'm not dead, so I guess I'll keep hey. going. Um, here, okay, so a list. We have uh, Leo Remini, uh, Tom Cruise, John Travolta, Jenna Elfman, Christy Alley. And I will finish reading those after I lose. Maybe it was Christy Alley. Fucking clotheslined by an apple. Shit, yeah, I got 
Is that an apple or a mango? Um, I think they're apples and oranges. I imagine they keep them to whatever fruit they were using for the... Oh shit! Oh shit! Um, well, I, I, I understand that, but is... Ah! That melon! The tile thing. Um, oh! Yeah, I'm not gonna make it. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. But is it, is it a mango or is it an apple? I think it's an apple. It almost looks like a mango with maybe. the coloration on it. Oh! Maybe it's a walnut fruit. Uh, the coloration, the coloration. I didn't make it either. Shit. Oh, bummer. There were a lot Let's of people in Yeah. Yeah, John Travolta. Uh... Here, start from the top. I want to hear them all. Oh, God. All right, hold on. Let me... Let me just find a bigger list of them. Because these are supposed to be, like... The one I was looking at is, like... Um... Prominent ones, but I didn't know half of them, so... Oh, okay. Yeah, let me just find a list here. Uh, Christy Alley... Ann Archer, Jennifer Aspen, Catherine Bell, David Campbell, um, Nancy Cartwright, Kate Severano, Erica Christensen, uh, Chip Coria, Tom Cruise, Sky Dayton, Jason Doring, Jenna Elfman, Richard Elfman, Doug E. Fresh, Isaac Hayes, Gary... Imhoff, Imhoff, Marcus Sham, uh, Vivian Kubrick, Juliette Lewis, Alana Masterson, Danny Masterson, Elizabeth Moss, Michael Pena, Bijou Phillips, Laura Prepton. No, oh, that's her. That's uh, Donna, Laura Prepton. Kelly Preston, Giovanni Rib Ribisi, Marissa Ribisi, Billy Sheehan, John Travolta, Greta Van Susteren. Joy Villa. Joy Villa. How many of those people did you recognize? Uh, 12. <laughs> That's about it. I don't know which one was Tom Cruise's wife. Maybe she, maybe they didn't include her since she left. Although, they guess they left in Leah Remini, so... I don't know. Hopefully most of those people have left. I don't know. I think those were just current members. Oh. Um, well. Because I don't, I don't think I remember seeing Leah Remini on that list. Gotcha. Uh, the, I was reading a list of people affiliated, so that could have been anybody who was current or left. Gotcha. What up, you fool? The shortcut doesn't work. Everybody knows this. There we go. Ooh, I actually made it out of there pretty pretty far up front. Kind like a riveting conversation right now. I know, I feel like I was going to say something about Scientology again. Maybe it was just going to be like... A fucking cult? Uh, it is a cult, but I was thinking more along the lines of you should watch Leah Remini's thing if you like to watch that kind of stuff. My mom's weird. She watches, like, every time... Every 9-11, she watches the 9-11 documentaries and... Like, she's seen them before. I've seen them enough times that I've remembered having watched the same ones twice, but every 9-11 she watches stuff about that, and she watches all kinds of, like, uh, not Snapped, but, um, Dateline, or, um, like, whenever they interrogate mass murderers or, um, serial killers, she likes to watch those interviews. Mom's weird. I mean... <laughs> I like those. I like um, like the interviews with like serial killers and mass murderers and stuff. Like that's cool. That's not cool. It's interesting, <laughs> I should say. That's, not... that's cool. Neat. Mass murders, cool kids. You did it. Go mass murder your friends today. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Might be. YouTube in trouble. told me to. We're gonna be oh. the new cause of mass shootings. It's not gonna be video mass games. Shooters. It's gonna be poops and giggles. Poops and giggles. That kid was a new terrorist Poops threat and giggles. on American youth. Yeah. I'm out. That one always uh, bothered me. The video game argument. Like most kids play mm -hmm. video games. I don't know why we don't all do that. So. It's almost like around. there's no correlation. Almost. I'm sure it gives some ideas, but it's certainly not the only factor. 
like you have to be able to one get the underage person a gun so maybe blame the parents i don't know just a mm -hmm. thought hot take on mass shooters so <laughs> In case anybody was wondering, that's our opinion on it. Don't shoot your friends. Don't, please. We've had Don't do that. too many. There's like... What What did... I saw a statistic. It was in the US, there's like a thousand a year or something. Which is like three a day. Um, which is crazy. Yeah. I don't know if it's quite a thousand a year, but it's... It's up there. It's too many. Th there's generally, generally about one every day, on average. I don't know what qualifies as a mass shooting. I don't know if it's like four people. I don't know either. Whatever the number is, it's too many. Oh, can you not? Can we not? We go. That's the ticket. Win it for us. Win it for us. Get five today. Did we? Is that going to be five? I feel like that was only three. I don't know. I think it was it's three. four or five. One of the two. I will have this video. This one's going to count for two. Okay. I'll look back at the video and I'll know. And anybody else can also do that. I'm not going to force myself to, in the future, figure this out. No, it's only you. Only you have the power to do such a thing. You, viewer, can also rewind. It's going to be incentive for you to go back and watch all of our episodes so you can note that before you start watching. And then somebody in the comments will comment what the number actually is and then you won't have to do that. Depending on, depending on when they're seeing this. They may or may not before somebody else does them a service. Don't... <laughs> Excuse you. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what I figured. <laughs> why are you picking... Why are you playing his game? Just fucking finish. I wanted to give people something to look at. Oh, okay. And sometimes I'll get people, so it's fun. <laughs> Doing it for the audience. <laughs> oh, I like when it's just one person. It was a really long <laughs> drum roll. <laughs> uh, unless that one person is me and then I feel silly. <laughs> Alright, Logan, the comedy's on you. You're not in. Give me some. What are we doing? Oh, God. Doesn't have to be a um, hypothetical, but tell me a story. Give me some. Give me something to look at. Uh, this is one time at band camp. Okay. Um, You're off to a terrible start. <laughs> my cousin actually went to band camp, so my family told that joke until it died. Oh, oh god. god. I felt really bad for him. <laughs> um <laughs> I don't think he did any kind of weird stuff with a flute, so could be wrong. Not that you know of. Not that I know of. I don't I'm sure he would tell me. What are you doing, dude? What are you doing? Monkey, are you kidding me? That was on you, man. Um I think I think we should start a D and D podcast. Absolutely. No, I'm kidding. We should do something D and D. Wait, why are you kidding? I think I think I think that would be fun. I think we could be real silly and do some silly things. I want to do stuff with. Um, well, I was. Uh, has Ashley said anything about Haley inviting her to play with us? No. What the hell, Ashley? Did Haley invite her to play with us, and I wasn't informed? No, not with us. It was our friend has a. Our friend is starting a campaign, and so we were gonna do if people oh. wanted to come do stuff. But you're up in Columbus, so. You're trying to keep it somewhat sure, I could I could zoom I could zoom call in. Yeah, but since Ashley doesn't want to do stuff because of quarantine, we were like, well, Ashley could zoom in, and then if that's the case, Logan could also zoom in. So Uh-huh. This is basically my invitation to you coming to play D D with us. <gasps> this is the first time hearing of it. Yeah. I'd love to. Because <laughs> I have I have one character that I used once uh, in a one off campaign yeah. and I really like him and I want to play as him again. Scored all by myself. Okay, who was, was that? The, I know uh, Ashley has a character. I helped Ashley build a character that she never got to use because oh. her friends bailed on the campaign I was going to run. Um, so, 
Who's playing defense? That, that could be a lot of fun. Because I'm scoring all our goals, so. You, you've scored one goal. Yeah, that's all our goals, Logan. Oh, that's two. You've Suck scored my two goals. <laughs> yeah, is that not enough? Are you not entertained? Uh, clearly not, because you're still losing. Yeah, we lost. It's okay. I Anywho. You. No, I actually didn't intend to invite you. Um, but we had a specific... I, I gave her a specific role that I wanted her to fill, because we just invited her after other people had made characters, so we were trying to get, like, a fairly balanced team. Did you need a healer? Yeah. It's always a healer. I always think, need a healer. But um, we were going to make her a druid, so it's not, like, completely... Oh, I mean, she was already a druid. Oh, okay. Well, then she can just do that. I don't yeah. know why I'm still yeah, watching. Yeah, the, the, the character I helped her build... I don't know. <laughs> the character I helped her build was a druid uh, tree elf, forest elf. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's very, very on-brand for her. Yeah, that's what I figured, I mean, based on her personality. Um, so anyway, if you want to make a character, I'm leaving. Please, thank you. Okay. Um, you're more than welcome. Oh, but do I have to make a character? I kind of just want to use the character I already have. Oh, yeah, that's what I mean. I, I just meant you can join. Yeah! What is your character? Is this the one that I know about? The barbarian that only says one word? Arthog? No, it's not Arthog. Not my troll. Um... Yeah, Arthur currently has two heads. Um, <laughs> you'll probably always have two heads because we will never finish that campaign. Oh. It's fine. It's all right. Who is your character? Uh, um, the one that I'm thinking of is... Uh, his name is Mordecai. He is a tiefling rogue. Uh, you know, very basic. Okay. Very uh, stereotype D&D uh, &D character. Little little devil boy who likes to steal things. Fair enough. But I've got I've got a stupid high um, sleight of hand stat. Like I think I've got like plus seven on my sleight of hand. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> and the first time I played as him in the one-off campaign, um, it was, there was three rogues because we were doing a heist campaign. Campaign. So it was three rogues. And as we were all sitting at the table getting details on the job we were supposed to do, I pickpocketed one of the I pickpocketed the person sitting next to me and then <laughs> used their coins to pay for everybody's drinks. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he's like a street busker, so he's um he's like always like doing little card tricks in the uh, the game with the cup and the ball. Right. He's doing that. He's pulling those kind of pulling that shit nice. a lot. Does he have some um, kind of magic to make sure that he wins every time? Um, he's just got a really high sleight of hand. Gotcha. Um, and then so I do have a I think it's thaumaturgy, which is kind of like a catch-all for like little parlor tricks. Mm -hmm. Um, and I think once I get the equipment, because I had to start with either cards or some sort of like. I had to start with the equipment for one specific game. Yeah. I chose cards because sleight of hand. Uh, but like if I get um, uh, like a balls in the cup, I'd probably have multiple balls to find which ball is correct. And I would just change the color of the ball because that's something you can do with thaumaturgy. Mm -hmm. You know, do some uh, do some shit like that. That one would be mean. <laughs> yeah. But see, the other thing is the cool thing with thaumaturgy, though, is like, like I said, it's a bunch of parlor tricks. So, like, one of the things you can do is change the color of your eyes or the color of your skin. Mm -hmm. And so, like, if I ever got into trouble, it's specifically because I'm a tiefling and people don't like tieflings, but yeah. if I got into trouble, I could change the color of my eyes from the gold that they are to some other color or change my blue skin to a different color. Um, and then he's got horns, obviously, because he's a tiefling. Yeah. But his horns are like uh, cartilage, so like they they like regrow. So he shaves them down, kind of like Hellboy does mm -hmm. in the uh, in the Hellboy movies. So he keeps them he keeps them shaved down uh, real neat uh, to pass for better as a human. Mm -hmm. So he can blend in a crowd. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, that's good. I was gonna say yeah. the horns would be hard to uh, miss, mm -hmm. but. Yeah, because so I don't think it's ever, uh, I don't think it's ever like established if the horns on a tiefling are bone based or if they're like cartilage based. Mm. 
Uh, I think you can pick, because you can have, like, goat horns, or you can have... I guess you could have... I guess they'd be bone horns. Right, I guess I, I guess not, like, cartilage. I guess it'd be, like, keratin. Yeah. Something that replenishes and grows. Yeah, and wouldn't hurt to cut off. Right. So, essentially, that's kind of his whole thing, is that he's a street busker, and if he gets into trouble, he can change his appearance to be not a tiefling pretty quick. Huh. And then I think I can also, I think I can also, like, imitate people. I think of, like, a feat or something that allows me to have, essentially gives me a, a bonus on imitation rolls or something. Imitation-based performance rolls or something like that. So, he's very, very sneaky, stealthy. Interesting. My character. He's a lot of fun to play. My character is a changeling, so I would know all about changing myself. Ah, oh, good. Yes. Yeah. Oh, baby. I'd have to get off soon and pay attention to my cat for a little bit. She's okay. getting needy. Haley's making dinner, so I should probably go help. Yeah, I should also make dinner. If we want to get off after this round, we can end the stream. Well, it's not a stream. We All right. End the game. I think that's, that's a good plan. All right. Is that your belly? My belly? That's my belly. <laughs> that could be a new game we play for the audience. Belly or hands? <laughs> Which is clapping? <laughs> is Logan clapping or is he slapping his belly? Clap or slap? <laughs> the clapper slap. <laughs> oh, look at you. Look at you. You're so cute. You're so cute. You're so cute. Yeah. Thank you. Not you. Oh, wow. You're handsome. Oh, let me fluff you. <laughs> <laughs> Gladly. No, I don't know if I could have a male fluffer. We're going to bring it full circle. I don't think I could have a male fluffer. Yeah. <laughs> full circle over the course of like five episodes. Yeah. You have to watch them all. To We've been recording for like three and a half hours. Killing it. <clears throat> have fun editing all that. Yeah, I'm still not done with the first session. I put too much effort into the editing. Nobody's watching yet. People Content are gonna be... quality has to be consistent. Oh my <laughs> god, I can't get up the hill! I know, people are going to be real disappointed when I start putting out... If I start doing episodes daily, it's not going to happen. <laughs> oh my god. Got the fucking... Oh my god, Moron Squad! Damn! I did not fall off once. I think I only fell over once. But literally, the five people that surrounded me kept getting hit and knocked over, and I kept tripping over them. Ah! Uh, Sorry. I hate that one. It's okay. I'm just. Yeah, no, that's not a good game. I mean, <sighs> it's an interesting idea, but uh, the design, <laughs> the design behind it is iffy. I, the physics of it is also goofy. Like, you don't move back as fast as you should, so people stay in place and knock you around, which is bullshit, but it's whatever. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna do? Hmm? What am I gonna do? Uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna watch you. Oh, okay. I'm it, watch you win. It was more of a... What is that? Uh, not a hypothetical. It was more of a... Where are those... <laughs> Bonk that guy in the face. <laughs> there we go. A hit by the hammer and then a hit the guy in the face. You're really trying hard just to get some eggs in there. There we go. There we go. What is the word? Why can't I think of that? <laughs> oh, it's gonna bother me. <sighs> I don't know what you're. I don't know what you're trying to get. I know. Drop the egg. Drop the egg. Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. I'm gonna figure this. Which, 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 which. 
I guess it is a figure of speech. Figurative? I don't even remember. I've what lost I said. track of this conversation. I don't even know anymore. Me neither. I don't remember what I even said. Was it funny? Probably not. Probably not. That's alright. Nobody's watching. Okay. We'll, we'll come into our stride. Eh. Eh. Egg. 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 I like to imagine that the music coming through on your end is not the same music coming through on my end, so I'm going to be over here singing music that is not matching up to what's actually on the video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it won't. I Actually, right now, I'm going to make sure, note to self, make sure Logan singing does not match the tune of the actual song. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. I'm going to desync your audio specifically for that joke. And it'll look silly all the way up until the end of our 10 episode series. When it finally pays off and I announce that I've been doing that as a joke the whole time. <laughs> it was totally intentional. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what the heck? Oh. Uh, Juking him out. Juking him out. Juking him. Doing great. Big proud. Yeah. Doing it. Oh, I should, doing it. should not have oh. done that. <laughs> Damn it. I should have just fallen down. I should have known the exact range of where I could jump. Damn it. Okay. Oh. I made a pass for rude. myself to get back specifically. Don't take my stuff. God damn it. <laughs> He didn't even take my stuff, he just left. God, okay, well. Oh no. That was fucking okay. terrible. It's okay. I'm sure the, the viewers will will forgive us. I'm so sorry. Alright, food. I like food. <sighs> yeah, me too. Alright. Cool. Alright. Sorry for the failure. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Sorry we suck. Okay, bye! <laughs>